Hello, my name is Gauri. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Hope you enjoy the video. Please show support by subscribing. Thank you. Mount Edith Cavell named after a British nurse for helping Allied soldiers in World War I. Mount Edith Cavell, previously known as Mount Fitzhugh, is a mountain located in the Athabasca River and Astoria River Valleys of Jasper National Park and the most prominent peak entirely situated within Alberta, Canada. It is located in a sub-Arctic climate zone with cold, snowy winters and mild summers. Precipitation runoff from the mountain drains into tributaries of the Athabasca River. The Hanging Angel Glacier is visible from Caval Meadows, which spills over a 300 meters cliff on the north face. The mountain was named in 1916 for Edith Caval, a British nurse executed by the Germans during World War I for having helped Allied soldiers escape from occupied Belgium to the Netherlands in violation of German military law. Mount Edith Caval was once featured on a $1 Canadian stamp back in 1930. Well, I drove from the lodge after seeing the um, glacial glaciers and the uh, skywalk I decided to check out the Athabasca Falls and then drove further towards Edith Cavell mountain named after nurse I guess she was mistaken for a traitor in World War I But the um, drive was unbelievably on a winding road, narrow winding road. Uh, it was just an incredibly beautiful drive, but very, very, you know, nerve-wracking because I didn't realize that it was going to wind, like, you know, in hairpin bends, like hundreds of them. Most of the time, you could only be driving like 10, 15 kilometers at the very most. But anyway, I made it. And I'm so glad because it was it's really worth it. You can still see some glaciers at the top of this mountain. There's a big hiking going on from here as well, which of course... I'm not going to attempt right now. The same road, like you know, that's veered off to come to this uh, mountain. I can take the same road uh, where the meeting of the rivers and all that. It's a beautiful side road actually right to Jasper just about another 15 kilometers farther is Jasper but of course tonight I'm not going there but tomorrow I'm heading there so this is the big quartz granite rock mountain that they were talking about Beautiful, huh? It's gorgeous. I can't believe it's like 15 degrees right now. There's a glacial ice underneath Mount uh, Edith Cavell, and you can see a lot of ice floating there. I did a 1.6 kilometer hike. It's an easy enough hike for my knees. It was worth the walk. Wow. Apparently in 2012 there was a huge 
chunk of glacial ice that fell okay. off this mountain. Okay. Have you see there? Right into this little lake. Was, the ice was equivalent to 14 school buses. That blueness in the ice comes from the oxygen being snuffed out of it, just like in ice cubes or when we really like pack the snow, how it becomes bluish, it's because of the lack of oxygen. That much I learned from my glacial walk today for sure. But wow, look at the ice floats. This is spectacular. Well worth that trip. The winding road. Wow. Can you see the glacial ice? Oh, what a beautiful, beautiful, spectacular. Spectacular scene here. Wow. I'm glad you're not allowed to go any more further than this because, you know, with my personality, I probably would have tried that as well. But oh my God, that is so breathtaking. They say this is the north face of the mountain. North face, just like Kailash, I guess has a more severe look to it. Oh, and I want to show this little falls. I, I even saw a mini little avalanche. See, there's a little falls melting of the glacial ice coming joining this frozen lake oh, stunning A lot of character to it. I can't believe how fortunate I am to be able to be here to enjoy all this while I still have an eyesight and a little bit of my knees left. Can't get enough of this color of this glacial ice. How cold the lake must be still for it to be floating. Oh, I think there must be some rain coming down. Hearing some kind of a thunder up there. Something must be happening there.
We really should get going. It's going to get dark soon and there's a lot of mountain driving. But it's so stunningly beautiful. I can't just leave this place. <laughs> Something must be happening there. Rain or just one more time. God, gorgeous. Peace. One more panoramic shot of Edith Cavell Mountain in Jasper National Park. Alberta. Today is October the 4th, 2014. Hi, I hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.